Josh, what about uh, talk a little bit about last night's uh, game? Just kind of your feeling coming in, seeing the big crowd, and just the emotions that were uh, that were out there last night. Yeah, it was an awesome, awesome experience. Um, big crowd. It, I mean, it, it kind of felt like a, a more of like a regional atmosphere um, almost. I haven't been to a regional yet, but um, when we play those guys, they they have a lot of guys that come out. They have a lot of fan. They have a big fan base. And we had a lot of fans come out yesterday too. So um, it was a it was a very exciting game. It definitely had to, um, uh, we had a lot of energy uh, in the in the stands and and on the field um, with with a good team. So um, yeah, it was, it was a great atmosphere. What does it mean to be uh, ranked in the top twenty five in multiple polls for the players? Yeah, it, it's a uh, it's a it's a good accomplishment, and uh, we definitely. Uh, we definitely look at it as 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 a success, um, but uh, obviously the ranking um, it does matter. But we we like to focus on the RPI a little bit more, just because that that's our um, our entrance into the regional. So uh, that's that's something we look at. But obviously we we enjoy um, being ranked in the top twenty-five. Knowing knowing that the committee will look at that RPI seriously, especially for a program like this. A month left of the regular season. How do you feel like that? Is, kind of, is that playing in your favor? Do you feel like it is? It is. It definitely is. Um, it is. Uh, it's huge. It's a huge. Um, it's an honor uh, to kind of be in that that position. And uh, we're the RPI. We're floating around like I think thirty, um, like lower lower forties uh, around there. Um, and and so last year I think we ended at thirty six or thirty seven. I think around there. Um, so we want to we want to kind of seep into the top 25 in RPI. I think that kind of guarantees us a shot into the regional. So. Do coaches talk to you guys about where you are in the rankings, or do you all just keep an eye on that individually? We, yeah, it's more individually. We all have Twitter, so we, we see, like, all the, the updated rankings and such. So I think it's kind of individual. We don't really we don't really like to talk about it as much. Um, but it, like I said, it's like it's a cool accomplishment, and we do, we do uh, recognize it. Are you guys looking at that a little bit more last year than this year, knowing how close you were and how that all played out? Yes, yes, we're definitely looking at it a lot more closer. I think uh, RPI we're looking at a little more closer this year just because that's kind of what I think kind of kept us out last year. So. What's been the key to all the success so far this season? Uh, we have a great team, a team that, that loves each other. Um, we, we all um, are for each other, um, and uh, we also have a lot of – we have a, we have great talent on the mound, uh, which is which has been shown this year, um, and we also um, have a pretty experienced lineup. So I think that's that goes to to show why we are where we are. You guys have climbed to the top of the conference standings, but still some tough series ahead. Yes. How do y'all keep your spot there at the top? Yes, uh, right now it's it's focusing on staying healthy as a team. Uh, right now we have a few people banged up, a few people. Uh, a little sick. I was sick a little bit last week, so it's kind of uh, staying healthy, uh, ma making sure we're taking care of our bodies, eating right, um, and also continuing to improve on the field. Did being left out of the tournament last year kind of spark you guys at all, or has that impacted the way you approach this season, Eddie? Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, that was kind of our goal to get get into the regional this year, um, get into the postseason. Um, and last year was a was a disappointment, big time. Um, and a lot of the returning players kind of made it their made it their deal to 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 get in get in and, and make sure we're in this year so uh, from your perspective as a catcher going through five six arms last night basically yep. uh how did you juggle uh you know learning specific guys and yep. knowing knowing situationally which pitches to try and pull out of them yeah the, <laughs> managing five guys in a game it, it can be tough especially as a catcher because you have to go with their strengths you have to go with um how they pitch because Every pitcher thrown out there is different. Different guy, the the spin's different. Um, so you have to kind of know what your matchups are, and uh, so yeah, we it was a little bit of a struggle. We didn't execute many pitches last last night as we should have, um, and what I what I would have liked to see. But uh, some some guys did great. Ruger Riojas was phenomenal last night. Um, so we we have some promising guys in the bullpen. What's been the difference for the whole staff to take a step forward this year? The numbers have been a lot better than the last couple seasons. Yes, the bullpen has been outstanding. I think that's the kind of the difference um, this year to last year was the, the performance out of the pen. Um, we have guys um, like Ruger, like Simon, um, like Schaefer, even though he didn't pitch all that great yesterday. But 
Uh, we have we have guys who have been been great out of the pen. How important are adjustments uh, this time of year? You know, you've been through about half the schedule. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of tapes out there on, on just about everybody. Mm -hmm. um, are pitchers uh, making adjustments like that in their in their repertoire right now to kind of keep a, one step ahead of the scouting report? Scouting so report. Uh, I would say a little bit here and there, but we try not to focus on that too much. The reason is, is because we have guys out of the pen who have, or even starters, um, have wonderful stuff. They have they have stuff that can beat hitters big time. Um, they have good fastballs. They have great breaking balls. So it's not a, it's not so much pitchers trying to defeat the hitters with with uh, I guess better preparation. It's more of attack with the best stuff that they have, um, and that's either the best their best fastball or the best breaking ball or whatever. So yeah. Thanks, Thanks.